Sometimes I don't want to destroy the bikes, yeah. but they must be destroyed. Yeah. You know, it's gonna be in this zone that it fails. The worst thing that can happen to a bike is head tube separation. Yeah. Right. So that's why we're pulling frames apart uh, to see how much force they can withstand before the head tube comes off. So this bike has already lived a life of abuse, so I don't feel too bad about um, ending it. It might be a bang, it might be a slow tear. The aluminum frames are not as spectacular as carbon and we see it holding and holding and holding until finally it deforms. And that's what we're really looking for because it gives a rider some time. So that's a thousand Newtons horse, 2000 Newtons, that's 3000. So we wanna see this one around, around 4000, just over 4000 Newtons. The force curve is starting to level off. So we're incurring damage onto the frame right now. That's the kind of failure we're looking for where the bike is still in one piece. Yeah. A situation no one should encounter mm -hmm. on their trail bike. <laughs> This will survive anything anyone can throw at it. You can see the down tube is totally wrinkled on the top at the shock brace and the top tube has started opening right up. 